As you probably already know, websites have pictures at the core. Gone are the days where websites were extremely simple with just a few paragraphs of text. A WordPress website uses photos for many purposes. From showcasing a beautiful featured image for a blog post to displaying a single product gallery for your online products or presenting a grid of products or posts, listing them all onto a page. The WordPress theme is responsible for rendering these images on the front end. The theme offers controls which you can use to customize how these images are rendered on the page. Today we'll talk about the image aspect ratio setting which can be found throughout Bloxy's options. The aspect ratio of an image is the ratio of its width to its height. It is usually expressed as two numbers separated by a colon such as 16 to 9, 4 to 3 or 1 to 1. This ratio describes the proportional relationship between the width and the height of the image. In layman's terms, the image aspect ratio setting automatically crops your photos so that they can be displayed consistently throughout the website, no matter what kind of photo you initially upload. Bloxy allows you to adjust the image aspect ratio at various places, such as the blog post or product cart's featured image, the featured image shown on a single post page, and even the single product gallery. We will check out an example of how to change the product archive page as well as the single product page. Then we will look at where you can find the controls for the other places, such as blog posts. As you can see, our shop here has a few example products uploaded. The products have a tall aspect ratio and they get automatically cropped since the options are currently set to crop images to a wide aspect ratio. We can fix this with just a few clicks. Before we continue, we must stress that this isn't a magic solution that will fix all images automatically. It is essential to have some consistency when you upload photos to the website as uploading randomly sized photos can impact the usefulness of the aspect ratio controls. To get to the image aspect ratio controls, we start with the customizer. For product archives, the option can be found under the product archives, cart options pane. Notice the product image layer here. Clicking on the drop down chevron gives you more options to configure the layer. What we're after here is the image ratio option. We have a few choices for customization. The original option does not crop the image in any way, presenting images as they were uploaded initially. This option can be good, but only if you have uploaded fully consistent images across the board. Otherwise, one photo might have a different size from another and so on. The predefined option lets you pick from a few preset image aspect ratios. The most common choices are available here, a one-to-one -one square off look, a standard 4 to 3 ratio, usually used for older TVs, a standard 16 to 9 ratio, which is used for modern widescreen TVs, and an ultra-wide 2 to 1 ratio. There's also a little toggle which lets you reverse the ratios, so they can become 3 to 4, 9 to 16, and 1 to 2, respectively. The last custom option lets you define your very own aspect ratio. There's even a little link to a handy tool that lets you calculate the image ratio for your existing photos. Let's get back on track. Since we have concluded what options are available, which one now is good for our design here? As we have uploaded tall photos, in this case, the best option would be a reversed 3 to 4 aspect ratio. And sure enough, after selecting this ratio, we can see that our product photos are now displayed correctly and consistently across the product archive page. But we are not done yet. Remember that we also have to fix the single product gallery aspect ratio. The options for this section can be found under the single product, product gallery pane. Notice that you get the same aspect ratio controls here, and we finish off the look by selecting the appropriate aspect ratio. Great, and that's all. You have now correctly set up the image aspect ratio for product archives and single product pages. It couldn't be simpler than this. However, we have mentioned that even blog posts have such options. Let's verify where these options can be found. For the main blog archive, the options can be found under the blog posts card options pane. Here is the featured image layer ready to be changed. Single posts also benefit from such controls. These can be found under the single post featured image pane. Of course, there are a few other places that also have this option available to them, but the gist remains the same the image aspect ratio options work identically across the system. Photos tell a thousand words, but having them consistent throughout the website makes them tell full-on fairy tale stories. And if you wish to learn more about what Bloxy2 has to offer, 
continue on onto our website or click on one of our other videos to keep watching.